ये जो इंडिया है ना इट रियली नीड्स टू हैव इट्स पेट्रियाकल एंड सेक्सिस्ट हेड एग्जामिन सेंजेवियस यूनिवर्सिटी और एस एक्स यू कोलकाता हैड अ चॉइस टू बी प्राउड ऑफ एम्प्लॉइंग एन असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर ऑफ इंग्लिश who had studied at St Xavier's College and Jadavpur University and had a PhD from two European universities or to be embarrassed by two pictures of her in a swimsuit sadly it seems St Xavier's University chose to be embarrassed it seems they chose to be sexist and regressive instead of standing by their female colleague instead of helping her find out how her privately posted social media pictures were dubiously made public it seems they chose to protect their own reputation even if that left the lecturer jobless and fighting a lone battle for justice the former assistant professor claims that st xavier's university authorities forced her to quit because she posted objectionable and inappropriate photos of herself on instagram which they alleged hurt the reputation of their university she claims that the process by which she was led to resign amounted to sexual harassment and character assassination for the record sxu rejects all her allegations and says the professor resigned voluntarily but let's not get caught up in the she said versus sxu said instead let's ask some questions The assistant professor was confronted by seven senior colleagues of SXU on 7th October 2021 there she claims a print out of two pictures of her in a swimsuit was circulated after which she was told that a parent of a student had complained that he had seen his son viewing her swimsuit pictures which the parent said were objectionable and bordered on nudity she was told this hurt the reputation of St Xavier's University and was asked for an explanation even as she confirmed the pictures were hers the professor raised a hugely valid point she said she had posted these two pictures of herself in a swimsuit 2 months before she joined sxu on her private instagram account which only those accepted by her as her followers can view these posts last for just 24 hours on instagram stories then they drop off social media feeds so How could the student of SXU have seen these pictures almost 4 months later? Clearly the lady's Instagram account had been hacked. Screenshots of her in a swimsuit had been downloaded and later circulated on the internet all illegally. So the question is, why didn't her senior colleagues at St Xavier's University leap up and say, "We support you?" Why didn't they say, "We are sorry this happened?" we recognize you are the victim of a cyber crime we will help you file a case with the police we are with you all the way till those who hacked your instagram account invaded your privacy and circulated your pictures illegally are brought to book why was none of this said to the 31 year old lecturer why didn't they say don't worry it doesn't matter if these pictures have gone viral we will speak to the students and to parents we will inform them about the facts of the case and ask them to also support you why did this university believe that standing up for her would hurt their reputation why not the opposite that standing up for her would enhance their reputation would earn them applause did they actually believe that two pictures of a faculty member in a swimsuit would corrupt the minds of their students i mean come on we are talking about students who today have free access to thousands and thousands of hours of highly graphic porn at the click of a button and even the kolkata police has questions to answer the lecturer claims she wrote to senior kolkata police officials in november 2021 but got no response she says she visited kolkata cyber crime cell twice only to be told by an officer that she was responsible because she had chosen to share the pictures an fir was finally filed only in february 2022 but so far there's been no progress in the case In March 2022 the lecturer sent St Xavier's University a legal notice over how she was allegedly made to resign but instead of reconsidering how they had dealt with her the university actually demanded rupees 99 crores from her for damaging its name and reputation the question we are left stuck with is why what explains the choices that this university seems to have made the answer lies in a khichdi of age old patriarchy brazen hypocrisy 
a complete lack of spine, sheer ignorance and simply not giving a damn about one of yours. Look around a bit and take a look at this recent video posted by actor Mukesh Khanna. कोई भी लड़की अगर किसी लड़के को कहे कि आई वांट टू हैव सेक्स विद यू वो लड़की लड़की नहीं है वो धंधा कर रही है यस दैट इज एक्स मिस्टर शक्तिमान सेइंग दैट इफ अ वुमन वांट्स सेक्स दैट मेक्स हर अ प्रोस्टिट्यूट वी हैव टेरिबली रिग्रेसिव फिल्म्स लाइक कबीर सिंह बिकमिंग सुपर हिट्स वी हैव मेन ट्रोलिंग तापसी पन्नू एंड आलिया भट्ट फॉर देयर रोल्स इन फिल्म्स लाइक थप्पड़ एंड डार्लिंग्स बिकॉज़ देयर कैरेक्टर्स फाइट बैक अगेंस्ट डोमेस्टिक वायलेंस we have bizarrely attacked women's choice of clothing from both directions we are not okay with a lecturer posting pictures of herself in a swimsuit nor are we okay with muslim women students attending college in a hijab and so as i said at the start ye jo india hai na it really needs to have its patriarchal and sexist head examined